Hello Sycamore class, Miss Cross here and today's activity is story time. We're going to read the story Pinocchio. While you're learning from home and not in school, you will be given lots of Pinocchio activities to choose from to enjoy at home. Make sure you're comfy, ready for our story. It's time to read Pinocchio. Once upon a time, there was an old man named Geppetto. He lived alone and longed for a child. One day, Geppetto made a puppet. He called it Pinocchio. One night, when Geppetto was sleeping, a blue fairy appeared. She cast a spell on the puppet. In the morning, when Geppetto awoke, he found that Pinocchio could speak and move. Geppetto loved and cared for Pinocchio like his own son. One day, Pinocchio saw a puppet show and he decided to join in. He did such a good job, he was paid five bronze coins for all his hard work. The same day, Pinocchio met a fox and a cat. They told him if he planted his coins under a magic tree, he would become rich. But they were trying to trick Pinocchio so they could take all his money. The blue fairy sent a dog to scare them off and it chased them away. The blue fairy asked Pinocchio, why have you not been to school today? Pinocchio replied, I have been to school. Pinocchio lied and his nose grew. The blue fairy asked Pinocchio where he had put the bronze coins. Pinocchio lied a second time and his nose grew even bigger. The blue fairy told Pinocchio his nose would only shrink when he told the truth. The next day, Pinocchio went to the circus with some boys. They ate lots and lots of sweets. But all of a sudden, the boys began to turn into donkeys. Pinocchio only grew ears and a tail because he was made of wood. He was thrown into the sea and his ears and his tail fell off. In the sea, Pinocchio was swallowed by a huge whale. His father was inside the whale too. Together they built a raft and they managed to escape. After they escaped, Pinocchio and his father got caught in a big storm. Pinocchio saved his father and helped them both get home safely. When they arrived home, the blue fairy waved her wand and turned Pinocchio into a real boy. Pinocchio and Geppetto lived happily ever after as father and son. I hope you've enjoyed listening to the story of Pinocchio. Let's see what you can remember about the Pinocchio story. Who is this character? Well done if you said Pinocchio. What did the Blue Fairy do to Pinocchio? Well done if you said, turned him into a real boy. Where did Pinocchio eat lots and lots of sweets? At the circus? Or at the farm? Well done if you said, at the circus. Why did Pinocchio's nose grow?
Well done if you said, because he lied. Great work answering all those questions. Let's have a look at what you can do next. Have a look at this week's activity bank. This has been sent out via email to your parents. Why not have a read through the different activities and choose the one that you like the sound of best. Don't forget to take lots of pictures and videos of your learning at home. Share these with your teachers through Evidence for Learning. See you soon, Sycamore. Bye.